the Cox's fortune was spent last season, £10 million in all, and they still failed to win promotion. Cox admits it's make or break for him this time, so Mark Pembridge's 10th minute penalty was a welcome start. It was Marco Gabbiadini who'd been upended for the penalty, and he then combined with Paul Kitson to make it two, five minutes before half-time. Gabbiadini scoring against the club where he made his reputation as a goal grabber. Derby have managed to squander two goal leads regularly in the nervy atmosphere of the baseball ground last season. So when Kitson teed up Pembridge, you had a feeling even Derby couldn't blow this sort of lead. In fact, they just kept adding to it. Sunderland, who missed the drop by a whisker, already looked like strugglers again. Paul Simpson's long run, a good stop by the goalkeeper, but Kitson left with the tap-in. At last, Derby were looking the part. Three of their million-pound men had scored. Now two million-pound defender Craig Short had his say. They've had a few false dawns at Derby in the past, but on this showing, this could at last be the real thing.